And the um, beetroot uh, supplementation has some unwanted side effects. What are they? Well, it, it can stain the saliva, the body fluids basically, the saliva, the urine, and, and the stools are a pinky, reddy, purpley colour, you know, so it's not really a, an unwanted or a harmful side effect, but you just need to be aware that it is going to change colours of uh, certain excretions. That said, I mean, it's a good, at least you know then that it's been effective in actually, you know, um, being absorbed into your body. And could you explain me the effects and mechanism of nitrate on performance? Yeah, so we think that when the nitrate is taken through a foodstuff, um, initially it gets converted into nitrite in the body. So the, the, the nitrate is swallowed um, and then that is transported in the enterosalivary circulation and it re-enters the mouth in the saliva. And then the bacteria in the mouth reduce the nitrate to nitrite the nitrite is subsequently swallowed and then can be absorbed into the bloodstream. So the plasma nitrite concentration is increased following beetroot juice or other forms of dietary nitrate supplementation and the nitrite is then transported in the blood and can be broken down further into nitric oxide uh, in, in areas where it's most needed. And we think that that's important in performance terms because nitric oxide has been shown to regulate muscle blood flow and also to regulate uh, muscle contraction energetics and possibly mit mitochondrial efficiency as well. So there's a number of reasons by which nitrate, by, by, you know, as long as it's turned into nitric oxide, could be uh, useful to physiological function and to exercise performance. And what's your practical recommendation to athletes to, to use the supplement? Well, we're still experimenting with the appropriate dose in order to get the maximum response. The studies that we've done so far involves the consumption of around six millimoles of nitrate. Now that is contained in around half a litre of normal beetroot juice, mm -hmm. although that can vary from you know, company to company. Um, but it is possible now to buy beetroot juice shots, which are a concentrated form of beetroot juice, mm -hmm. which contain the same amount of nitrate, but in a reduced volume of fluid. And the important thing is that the nitrate is consumed about two to three hours before exercise is commenced because that gives sufficient time for the nitrate to be converted into nitrite. And should they consume this over a long time period or just for a short period? That's another very good question and we don't know the answer to that question right now. We know that the effect uh, you know, works acutely, so if you take nitrate uh, in the diet then two or three hours later your blood pressure will be a bit lower. Mm -hmm. If you exercise your oxygen uptake is slightly lower also and your performance may be slightly improved. And we can continue to supplement for up to 15 days is as far as we've gone in our studies and we don't lose that effectiveness. But that said, um, we don't know whether continued nitrate supplementation may or may not enhance the training responsiveness.